Hello, 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 and welcome back to Let's Play Earthbound. I'm Amanda, and we're back to play some more Earthbound. Um, uh, I know we were on our way to Tucson last time, but I forgot to come back to this guy's house. Remember, uh, we stopped by here on the way up to the meteorite? Well, if you come back here now... <laughs> yeah, um, wow. <laughs> We're gonna follow this guy into his basement. Which totally doesn't sound creepy at all. But he wants to show us something, so we'll go check it out. It's a trap! What? Oh, some kind of glowing statue with sparklies. Creepy noises, that's great. Well, that's not gonna be the last time we see that. You'll see a little bit late. Well, you'll see it in the um, next few videos or so again, probably. Anyway, we should go and get our butts to Tucson, huh? actually show one of the crows that I I might as well even though I hate these things. If it steals a hamburger from me or something, I'm gonna be mad. Oh never mind. <laughs> oh don't give me a cookie. No do not want the cookie Totally no use for it, but whatever. It's just thrilling, isn't it? Oh, uh, maybe I should just cut until we get to Tucson so you guys don't have to keep watching this. Uh, we'll be right back. Now, I don't know if you remember from before or not, but uh. Well, I guess you wouldn't know. I didn't actually come down here, did I? <laughs> Well, if you came down here earlier, there would have been roadblocks and stuff you wouldn't be able to get through. But now that we got Captain Strong, or Chief Strong, or whatever, to let us go through, we can head on our way to Tucson. Hmm, what's this? <laughs> Red free in a mouse's house. I guess that's one way not to pay money. Of course, how the mice afforded a house is beyond me. But they're cute, aren't they? Yep, these are called exit mice. Whenever you're in a dungeon or some long thing like that and you don't want to walk all the way back out when you get to the end, just use the exit mouse, he'll find the way out and take you right back to the beginning. Pretty useful. Presents! Oh, come on. Well, <laughs> well, you know it's a hamburger. Oh yeah, that's one of the items I picked up over at uh, Giant Step. Cold Remedy? I'll show you what we use those for later. Uh-oh, new enemy. 
I really hate these things. Well, I guess we're getting lucky this time. He's not scattering his spores. If he does that, we'd get mushroomized, which is really annoying. Turns your controls around and everything. Oh wow, three of them. Oh, what the heck? <laughs> oh jeez. I thought black antoids would run from me now. Apparently not. Oh well, we'll see if he does his little thing this time. I'm gonna take out this first. Oh crap. There it goes. <laughs> well, we got a mushroom on our head now, and we're going to start acting funny, which... It's actually probably one of the most dangerous status ailments in this entire game. So you attack yourself, you attack your party members. Oh, I think... Does Tucson even have a hospital? I'm gonna check. Oh yeah, they do. So we're just gonna walk over here and get rid of this mushroom before it starts turning our controls all wacky. Of course, it probably will before I get there. If I randomly... What the? Oh. Well, here's the photographer that I didn't get to show you the last time when I skipped over him accidentally. See, fuzzy pickles! He's gonna pop up everywhere in the game. Well, not everywhere, but you know, a lot of different spots. He'll just stop you and you'll have to get your picture taken. It's kind of an interesting feature, and you'll get to see all the pictures at the end of the game. What the? Should we fight him? Probably not with a mushroom on our head. Oh, I went past the hospital. That's great. Oh, he's still there. I'm just going to try to avoid him. <laughs> Oh crap, it's changed my controls. Eh. Yeah, I'm. Wow, it changed again. That's really annoying. Yeah, I know I suck at this. We're gonna wanna talk to the healer. He's the one who's gonna help us out here. This guy with the- oh my god, do my controls have to keep changing? Oh, wow, fail. And they changed again! Wow, um... <laughs> eh. Just wanna talk to you, dude. As you can tell, I'm not very good at this. Uh, talk to us. Talk. No, talk. Thank you. Absolutely, dude. 50 bucks for a mushroom. <laughs> oh, nothing else, thanks. And yeah, we're good on that. Yeah, I know this has been a pretty unproductive video so far. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> We've got a, a few things to do here in Tucson before we move on. We'll check out the park and, uh... Check out the house of that girl who's been talking to us in our dreams. Uh, there's a couple other things to do. Oh yeah, we gotta talk to, uh... Apple Kid. Maybe I'll go and do that first. How much money do I have on me? Um, okay. It's not enough, is it? Ba, ba, ba. Uh, hotel's not far from here. We'll stop and get a little bit of money. Hey look, it's Mr. T. Oh, we don't manage to get run over, I don't know. <clears throat> yeah, 
yeah, if you go in these back doors here, you can usually find an ATM. Sweet, we have money. Uh, I'm gonna take out a bit, because once we go to the park, it's probably gonna be some other stuff I wanna buy. Shall do. Isn't that nice? We just go in a hotel and use their stuff and leave. Where are the kids? Oh, they're all the way down there, aren't they? Short. More walking, walking. Chaos Theater. We'll be going back there pretty soon to talk to those guys up there. And that's Berglund Park, where we're also going to go. There we go. First time I played this game, I gave money to Orange Kid. Completely useless. We'll give you this one stupid item that plays like Ode to Orange Kid or something and it just breaks after the first time you play it. It's completely useless. You're gonna wanna give money to this kid though. Don't forget, you're gonna need to do this to advance in the game anyways. Yeah. Yeah, it does look pretty messy, buddy. <laughs> well, I guess uh, we're right up there with him since we don't change our clothes or anything. It's all good, Apple Kid. Yeah, you gotta come here with a food item for him. I got plenty of hamburgers, so... Just give him one of those. Oh, yes, we would! Sure, we'll give you 200 bucks. Even though we have no idea who you are and we just walked into your house. Nah. If there's anything in there, I won't be able to get this item. Oh, no, no name for the cute little mousey. Receiver phone. Zip. Well, unfor. Well, if we can get through this battle before time runs out. Darr! You know what? Screw it. We're going to use our Sai Duck. Hopefully, not die. Oh snap, we got a level. Really crappy one, but yeah. I'll just use this quick, and uh, that's going to be it for this one. We'll get more done in the next video, hopefully. Oh, sorry, I should have taken care of that liar, exaggerant guy's stuff earlier. My bad. Anyways, I'll see you next time. This is Let's Play Earthbound with Manda, and uh, have a good one, guys. Bye bye